The nine-year NBA veteran Lance Stevenson is back on the Pacers and within just four games the air guitar is already back. But he's actually earned it. So far in those four games, he's averaging 14.3 points and six assists. I really don't know if it's the coaching staff or what, but whenever Lance plays for the Pacers, he gets a plus five to all of his attributes. He was picked up by the Hawks originally when teams were picking up anybody they could, but he really wasn't able to play his game there. He played in six games, averaging only 1.8 points on just 11 minutes. He didn't necessarily play bad, he just really didn't fit and got very few minutes. But with the Pacers, he's been performing way better than really anybody expected and is the perfect dude to have when your team's missing players. Against the fully stacked Nets, he dropped 30 points and 5 assists, shooting 63% from the field. He also shot 50% from 3. Then again last night versus the Jazz, Lance came off the bench and dropped 16 points along with a career high 14 assists. This is the same dude that in the beginning of the season was literally drafted in the G League draft. Even in the G League though, he was averaging 19.7 points, 8 rebounds, and 4 assists a game. But honestly, it gets even crazier than that. The last time Lance played a game of NBA basketball was back in 2019 with the Lakers. Then, during the time Lance actually wasn't in the league, he was playing in China where he would not only win a title, he would also average 27 points, 7.5 rebounds, and 4 assists a game. And yes, he was the exact same dude while he's playing in China. But that's what you love about Lance. No matter the team he's on or the situation he's in, you know he's going to bring the energy. He's great with the ball in his hands and has surprisingly good IQ. Then on top of it, his defense is pretty good as well. If there's any team that knows how to use him though, it's gotta be the Pacers. So the big question's honestly gonna be if they'll actually sign him to a full contract or not. He's currently your best player off the bench and a huge spark when he's in, kinda like Pat Bev. He even got a technical foul for grabbing the ball after scoring a layup. He's gonna just tap the ball with his right hand. But after last night, I feel like it's kinda guaranteed. As a struggling team, there's no point in not giving him a contract. The Pacers really don't have much to lose knowing they're 15 and 25 at the 13 seed, so they'll probably keep him because he's better than rolling the dice on a random G League player. Even though he technically was, but come on now. Lance hasn't had the best consistency in his career, but he's 31 and can still get the job done. He went to China and through the G League to get back to where he is, so you better know he's gonna make sure he stays this time. Hate him or love him, you gotta respect the hustle. But that about wraps up the video, if you did enjoy, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for videos just like this one. Also, check out some of the other videos on the channel, I promise they're bangers. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time.